Hello, frugal friends. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for joining me for our weekly word. We'll be studying Philippians 4 through 9 today. Rejoice in the Lord always. And again, I say rejoice. Let your meditations be made known unto all men. The Lord is at hand. It says, the translation says gentleness. So let your gentleness be made known unto all men. So no matter if they agree with you or they don't agree with you, whatever their opinion or your opinion differ, we can still be kind to one another. We can still be gentle. We are told to do that. So let's try to do that if we can. Be careful for nothing, but in everything, by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known unto God. So it says, be anxious for nothing. Then it tells us to pray. So today I want to pray for our our school year, 23 through 24. So you can join me in this. You can pray right there where you're at. You can come in agreement with me because when two or more agree, the devil is done. Okay, so let's come in agreement. Well, let's say amen, but let's pray for our, our teachers and our students this year. Father God, we come before you right now, Father. And we pray for this nation all over, the north and the south, the east and the west, Father, over every school, daycare, pre-K, middle school, elementary, high school, college campuses. We pray over all the children, all the students, all the faculty, all the teachers, Father. We ask that you cover them with your mighty hand, Father God, that no tricks of the devil be allowed against them, that whatever Satan means for their harm, you would turn it around and use it for their good, Father God, that no weapons of any kind that are formed against them to prosper. In Jesus' most holy name we pray. Amen. Okay, so let's pick up where we left off. And the peace of God which surpasses all understanding shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Finally, brother, whatever things are true, whatever things are honest, whatever things are just, whatever things are pure, whatever things are lovely, whatever things are good, if there be any virtue and if there be any praise, Think on these things. Meditate on these things. So meditate on what's good because there is still good in this world. You're good, right? Um, there's a lot of things that we see that's happening that's good. We see people helping one another, praying for one another, supporting one another. So let's look at all the good things. And of course, you know, as we just pray for our babies going to school, they're good. So let's pray over those things and meditate on those things. Those things which you have both learned and received and heard and seen in me do. And the peace of God shall be with you. So God's peace is going to be with us. So let's pray. Meditate on things that are good. Oh, what's the best thing of all? God, right? Jesus. So let's meditate on them. I think that's what he's trying to tell us. Because, yeah, he's lovely. He's good. He's pure. So let's meditate on God. So thank you for joining me today. And as always, be blessed, you guys.